Now, while discussions take place in Bonn, the European Parliament is set to vote on a series of EU climate change policies over the week. The plans essentially aim to reduce net greenhouse gas emissions by 55% by 2030. Under the EU's complex lawmaking process, the Parliament will debate eight proposals today and vote on them on Wednesday. In order to confirm which proposals will be discussed in the final legislation, one of the proposals, including the biggest overhaul of the EU's emissions trading system since its launch in 2005, the proposal, if approved, would reinforce the scheme to cut emissions by 61% by 2030. Another proposal is set to cut carbon emissions from new cars by 2035, which will ban new combustion engine car sales in the European Union. The highlight will be the EU's fir world first plan, which will impose CO2 levy on imports of carbon intensive goods like steel and cement. While EU lawmakers debate the bloc's future climate policies, few non profit organizations have challenged one of its proposed plans. The plans that have been legally challenged aim to fast track funding and permits for 30 gas projects. The organizations have claimed that Brussels proposed the list of projects without considering the effects of methane emissions. As per experts, methane will contribute 85% more in global warming than carbon dioxide in the coming 20 years. The EU executive branch will have 22 weeks to revise its proposal or prove that it does not violate environmental law should the Commission fail to offer a satisfactory legal justification. The case could be taken to the European Court of Justice, potentially holding our progress on $13 billion worth of projects. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.